We are in a perfect position to take the plastic out of the river just before it enters the oceans. And I'm really excited that the know-how that we have, that the capabilities we have, we can apply here on this spot and that we are going to contribute to a better world and take plastic out of the rivers before it enters the oceans. I think it is essential for the ocean cleanup not just to pick up plastic from the ocean and that is exactly what we're doing here. This is really going to do the job and now we really have a machine that we can show to the world that is a strong performer and that can actually take any load from the river that we uh, expect uh, with the knowledge that we have today. Indeed, this is a project that is executed under confidentiality because we want to have the momentum of presenting this after we have proven that it is uh, functional in an environment where we take plastic out of the water. It's an undercover operation and that puts some yeah, uh, stress or specific requirements to the, uh, the people who are working on it because of course they, they want to know what it is, they are proud of what they are doing, they want to show off but they have to keep silent. in Malaysia and uh, assemble this same thing in Malaysia with local people and put it in use in just a few months time. I have to try to understand this, see what is the best way to assemble, what should I remember, what should I uh, maybe think of a way, what's the best way to do it. Wat het verschil tussen deze spanten zo hier links en rechts zijn die niet gelijk? Die zijn gelijk. Ja, oké. Okay. Alleen uh, het eerste spant, nee, alleen het laatste spant is anders. En dan hier, okay. hier in de midden hebben we een keer twee keer een half. Voor de rest zijn ze eigenlijk allemaal uh, precies zo. Oh ja. Yeah. So I'm really happy to be here and uh, to be part of this. And uh, just imagining how this will look in other parts of the world. This is the first time that you get an impression of the ultimate dimensions of the system. It's uh, quite impressive compared to what we've seen before. If you see the assembly parts first, then it's uh, surprising to see how big it is ultimately going to be. Like a big insect. Looks impressive. 
going really fast. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Hey. <laughs> Just in time. Yeah, yeah, perfect. <laughs> hey, look at We started developing a river cleanup system about two and a half years ago. And from the first inception of, of the idea, we developed prototypes and improved the system. And this is actually uh, probably system number six or so that we, uh, that we thought of. But we've actually constructed uh, a, a few. And we've been on road, obviously, developing this technology for a long time. So sometimes it's been hard. I had to bite my tongue, look, look we're trying, we're doing it, but uh, uh, all in all I do agree that it's best to show uh, what we can do once it's finished and um, yeah, I'm pretty eager to start showing and telling the world what we have developed. Yeah, we're starting with installation of these machines in locations where the pollution in rivers is very big and where the circumstances are very typical of the type of circumstances you would encounter if you want to do this on a massive scale, where it needs to cope with massive wet season peaks and tropical uh, conditions and all of the problems surrounding it. I really love being part of this mission, of this group, uh, working towards a solution. It's really complicated and I really like complicated problems and I really love that we are very close to actionable solutions. Um, it's it's a, a very adventurous journey that we're on. What we see now is some of the moving parts coming in. They have this nice blue accent color. And the next step will be that we start outfitting the electricals, put in the electrical cabinets. As we say in shipbuilding, it, get, it gets dressed. <laughs> That's always an interesting phase because you don't see it growing, it doesn't get any bigger, but there's still a lot of added value to be installed on board. And, and these are the first moving parts. So that's very interesting to see how that is uh, mounted and you get a first glimpse whether the functionality is going to be what we envisioned. So yeah, it now really becomes interesting. This is the first time that you can see how it is arranged, how it is uh, in the actual working position. So yeah. It gives a first good impression of the functionality and the way I see it, um, I can perfectly envision that this is going to work. So, yeah, it gives me confidence, yeah. We have received the first parts of the uh, exterior. So yes, I expect next week that we are going to see the last big changes in uh, the looks and from then on it's all interior work.